We've just released version 1.3 of Blogpad Pro, which is packed with new features, improvements and bug fixes. I'll run through some of the main updates and we'll be adding more videos showing you the features in more detail. First, let's talk about translations. We've now translated Blogpad Pro into Spanish, German, Italian and Polish, as well as the original English. When you first install Blogpad Pro, it sets the app to be in the same language as your iPad. However, you can manually change the app language yourself. Just go to General Settings, Language for Application, and select your language. You'll also notice underneath that there's an option for your spell check language. You might want to have the app in English, for example, but be writing all of your posts in German in which case you could change your spell check language to German. Spell checking is available in lots of different languages, including Danish, German, Spanish, French, Italian, Dutch, Portuguese, Russian and Swedish. You can also choose between Australian English, Canadian English, US English and British English. When you've selected your languages, just tap Done. Another major change in this version of Blogpad Pro has been to our visual editor. There have been lots of improvements here, so let's open up a post and take a look. The first thing you'll notice is that the buttons are larger. This is after feedback that the buttons can be a bit small on the iPad Mini. Also, larger buttons help you to avoid hitting the wrong button. This is why we also moved the save button slightly to avoid you accidentally hitting the save button instead of the post options button. You'll also see that there are lots more buttons. You can expand and collapse the extra row by tapping on this icon here. To make life easier, Blogpad Pro will also remember whether you left the menu bar collapsed or expanded when you next edit a post. Some of the exciting new options we've added into the visual editor include a spell check, which also includes a word count, and also a search option, which includes search and replace. You can drag these palettes to wherever you want to on the screen, and their position will be remembered even after being hidden. We've also added Markdown support. So you can add your Markdown here. Our editor converts Markdown to HTML and vice versa, so it works both ways. We've also moved the Save, save Your Changes bubble and the Auto Saving bubble so that it isn't covering up any of your text. Onto the second row, you'll see we've added font styles like Paragraph, Heading 1 and Heading 2. You can also change your font, the size of your font, your text colour and your text background colour. You can even get Blogpad Pro to remember your favourite colours. The arrow button adds a single line space and you also have a Next option which you can use to add paging within your blog post. You can also now indent and outdent paragraphs of text. You can also insert tables. I'll quickly show you how easy this is. There you go. Our visual editor also now supports Text Expander Touch, which allows you to use your Text Expander shortcodes within the visual editor as well as in the HTML and Markdown modes. We believe Blogpad Pro is the first and only app to offer this functionality in the visual editor. If for some reason you want to disable Text Expander touch support, you can do this in your general settings. Another change is the way you insert images. You can now take a photo from directly within Blogpad Pro, and you can also link to your Dropbox account and insert images from there. Just go to Other and add a link to your Dropbox account. As well as adding images from Dropbox, you can also insert a link to different file types. 
for example Word documents or videos. We've always offered stats for WordPress.com blogs, but we now also support stats for self-hosted WordPress blogs that have the Jetpack plugin. Just tap on the Stats button. Other improvements include being able to add multiple user accounts for the same blog so that different users can work separately. So that's a rundown of the new features. Thanks to everyone who got in touch with ideas and suggestions and we hope you enjoy Blogpad Pro 1.3